Hello friends, so now that we download and install the MetaExploit Devils, let's now configure uh, the MetaExploit Devils. So just press start. So uh, as I said, you need to first configure a couple of things like your system give that a 2 2 gb memory and make sure you have at least to give that a 2 processor and this is the important part for your network otherwise you cannot connect this meta exploitable server to your any like Kali linux machine or any other machine for testing purpose so make sure if you are using on wireless network or wi-fi adapter like i am using so make sure you use breeze otherwise you use net network so then so as i as so what is the meta exploitable login username which is uh, msf admin so press enter and the password msf admin so if you type password it won't show uh, in linux because it's for the security purposes so just press enter and it's on uh, meta exploitable login so let's just so let's see what is our uh, ip in this uh, meta exploitable server i have config to check your ip as you can see our ip is 192.168.1.104 so we will use kali linux to test this uh, meta exploitable server to check whether it's working or not so let's open our Kali Linux machine Meta Exploitable is best for penetration testing as we all know so we will also go to and check couple of the lab or vulnerable website if it's working or not So let's log in our Kali Linux machine. So this is uh, this is the IP address or INET address that you are seeing. This is our Meta Exploitable web server. So just type this web server in here in, in this machine that you want to pen test so let's check this uh, web server 192.168.1.104 as you can see meta exploitable web server is up and running and you can do any of this thing in here you can check php my admin you can do metal day and all of those like testing injection cross side scripting all of those in here you can also do dvwa so let's just try to see if our you need to actually do anything just you need to select your network properly otherwise you cannot connect to this uh, web server which is our penetration testing or vulnerable web pages for penetration testing so make sure as i said so make sure you always check this one otherwise it won't work this is the main part so let's uh, user is uh, maybe admin password is uh, as far as i know it is password so let's just log in as you can see you can do any of this testing uh, boot force execution sql injection all of those in here using uh, this meta exploitable uh, as virtual machine so you can do all of those things in our kali linux or you can do all of those things in any ubuntu machine so as anything you want so as you can see a uh, lots of things you can do using this uh, meta exploitable tool you need to actually these things you can do in uh, Kali Linux machine without uh, this uh, meta exploitable but it's tough and it's uh, you have to do many things you have to type more 
commands you need to install couple of the tools you need to install every tool separately in Kali Linux so that you can uh, visit uh, even though if you uh, connect it won't work because sometimes many errors show up so it's better to just use a meta explorable machine as this so you can do many stuff so you can want in here as you can see you can do cross-site injection you can do reflected persistent cookie injection all of those in here using this simple meta exploitable machine so that's how you configure using this meta exploitable so how to turn off this you just type power off power off uh, you need to be root okay so you need to be root to be power off so what you need to do you need to type sudo sudo then power off as you can see you will ask for password which is msf admin then just press enter and it's done as you can see it will it will take some time to close but it's better if you close this way rather than using this power of button it's better and it will process all the things and it will stop all the services this way and that's uh, all about this meta explorable uh, virtual machine